Hey, what's going on guys? Good morning, I appreciate you stopping by. This is the first Artisan Spotlight Week. We are highlighting Sterling Soap Company. We're gonna get into all the details about the specific scent, the ingredients of Sterling, pricing, and that type of thing. Uh, everything that you'd like to know, if you'd like to know anything further in, in future videos, just uh, comment down below and we'll make sure to add that. But other than that, let's get to it. So we're gonna use our QED Select brush here. It's a badger brush, the Murica razor. So we're gonna be using here. It has a second use Balzano blade in it. All right, so let's go ahead and pour. I did bloom the puck. Go ahead and put that on the face real quick. Great scent on this. It's a fun, sweet scent. If you don't like overly sweet, you may not like this. I'm gonna run some water really quick. This is a very, uh, very, very sweet uh, scent. So, all right, let's begin lathering. Hope everybody had a great new year. So, Sterling, I'm gonna throw on the glasses because it's difficult for me to see even now while I'm shaving, I'll take them off. But So, uh, the scent on Weekend in Malibu, citrus, vanilla, sandalwood, lily of the valley, and musk. This is a very, very nice, fun scent. Um, like I said, it is it is very sweet. Just look at this. Look at this lather. All right, we're good. Put whatever's in the tub on the face. So the ingredients that Sterling uses are also <laughs> very very good, and we'll get the pricing, and that's also extremely good. So uh, I've always said Sterling is a quality soap at a phenomenal you know price point. It's great value, absolutely great value. So ingredients are uh, beef tallow, stearic acid, water, castor oil, potassium hydroxide, uh, uh, vegetable glycerin, fragrance, almond oil, uh, shea butter, coconut milk, lanolin, sodium hydroxide, and sodium lactate. Pricing for Sterling. These are all of their soaps, I'm fairly certain. The 5.8 ounce tub, which is what I have here, 5.8 ounce, ton of soap in here. I've scooped out the, the outside here for either my bowl lathers for this specific tub or sending samples out to some buddies. Um, but I've, I've used this and I've sent out probably enough samples for 20 plus shaves and uh, we have so much, so much soap left. But 5.8 ounces at 14.25, which comes out to 245 an ounce, that's the best you're gonna get at Sterling. Um, very, very great pricing from Sterling. And look at this lather. We have the refill pucks that you could buy from them for uh, their 4.5 ounces, four and a half ounces at 11.25 or 2.50 an ounce. So about five cents more per ounce what you're paying with the refill puck and then samples one ounce for $4.10. So if you don't want to buy a whole tub, you could buy the sample. But just look at the base. I mean, it's it's not lacking anything. It's super slick. It's that that single layered but multi layered density that I always talk about. Great for straight razor shaving. I've never had an issue with Sterling in straight razor shaving. We're done. Nice creamy dense lather here. You might notice we have some different lighting. I'm actually not using my uh, the typical lamps above my uh, mirror here and um, <clears throat> went ahead and purchased some LEDs specifically for this mirror. So that's all I'm using. Everything else in the bathroom is off. You'll have to tell me if it's better or worse or whatever. Um, but anyway, Merc. Let's get to it. Take off the glasses. We, we've gone over everything. I plan on doing 
I have four I have four sterling soaps. So I think um, between the first and first and seventh or first and eighth. Every other day there will be an upload. Which is quite a bit more than I've been doing um, for the third and fourth quarter of last year, 2023, uh, 2022. Beyond the artisan spotlights and, and kind of what I'm doing here with Sterling. And then um, uh, after Sterling, I think I'm going to do Crown and Crane. That'll be the next artisan spotlight week or weeks because I have a ton of their soaps, but aside from that, I have a very, very um, fun announcement. I don't know how to, how to put it, but uh, in the near future, probably another two weeks or so, I'll, I'll be announcing it. I've taken this specific process very, very slow for 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 good reason, and and I'm happy with with how everything's going, and I can't wait to announce it to you guys. But I don't want to say anything too much too soon. Um, you know, I don't want to put the cart before the horse. I want to make sure that everything is solid before we continue. But pretty cool stuff coming. I fill my hands up with a little bit of water here and do. A, Quick rinse, and we'll lather up again. Oh yeah. How do you not like Sterling? And I know some people might not, you know? Um, for me, the value you're getting is is so sublime. It's, I don't know, you know? Sterling's one, and, and I don't know, Sterling is one of the companies along with with Razor Rock the Italian bar in, in my opinion that just their soaps are their soaps are absolutely needed in in the wet shaving space Sterling has a ton of sense so does Italian Barber um, the value is there I think Italian Barber also does over five ounce tubs of soap pretty sure they'll be they'll have a spotlight on this uh, channel as well in the coming weeks or months. Get the lather. We're only gonna do a two-pass shave here. But yeah, these companies are absolutely needed. And you know, I know Sterling does well. Um, and it's it, it's always it's always a good thing to hear when you when you know all of us are supporting not only the 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 real big artisans but also kind of Big in price is, is you know what I mean, but but also the, the the value market as well, which I would put Sterling in. Um, but when I say value, I don't mean quality is not hindered by Sterling or Razor Rock's value. Um, that's not always the case in in all aspects of life, or in wet shaving for that matter, but. Um, Sterling and, and Razor Rock do not, this is a Sterling spotlight, I'll stop saying Razor Rock, Sterling does not lack any quality for the price that they that they offer, and it's, it's just phenomenal. Like I said, I only have four Sterling soaps. Um, I've gone through two of the samples as well. I'll be honest, I am ashamed to not have more Sterling soaps if I'm being frank with you. I'm not frank, I'm Tony. No, but um, you know, I, I am, I, I do need to pick up some more Sterling. I forgot what movie that was. 
Tall's from. I'm not Frank Gum Tall. Anyway. <laughs> Forget me. Yeah, the scent, um, scent strength, I would say probably, mm, probably about a six and a half or seven once lathered. Rinse out the sink, do a little rinse. I don't know if we have, I know we have a little bit of irritation. I think you could probably see that pretty clearly with uh, the lights, but I don't know that we have any weepers so I can't see anyway with my glasses oh very nice so I'll probably keep these spotlight videos uh, to two passes and the main reason for that is because if I go three passes one with the last one being against the growth I won't be able to shave every other day which kind of ruins the timeline that I want to get these out so, yeah, the videos will be a little shorter, so they'll be easier to consume for you guys. And it'll leave me. Now, I, I'm completely, as far as like across the growth, and, and obviously with the growth, I'm completely baby bottom smooth. But if I go like against the growth, I have just, you know, the, the very minute stubble that you really can't even see, honestly. You could definitely hear it. All right, one more. One more little rinse. That scent is still lingering, which I really, really like. Very nice. Okay. Um, we're going to throw on some... Let me use my... Oh, Razor Company towel. Kind of pat dry. Oh. And then we will... I'm just going to squirt on. This is not a uh, Sterling Soap uh, uh, Sterling Soap Company uh, splash. I'm just going to kind of squirt whatever I have in this bottle on. Mm. It actually matches. It blends. It blends pretty well with, with um, Weekend Malibu. Uh, Malibu. It's a nice, like, aquatic, sweet aquatic scent. Wow. That that might be, hmm. I do like that. That's really nice. Anyway, all right. <laughs> I go off on these little tangents, and then I can never get back on track. All right, guys, that's it. Hope you enjoyed. Like I said, if you have any uh, way to make these videos a little better in the following videos, just comment down below. Let me know. Um, since I'm making them before I upload them, I'll probably make another one or two before this one's uploaded just so I can have a couple lined up. So if you comment on this video, some changes, you might not see those specific changes within the next one or two videos after this one, but that you will eventually start seeing the changes that you say. So if they're good changes, um, other than that, yeah, guys, very, very, very nice shave. I enjoyed it. I've got to see. I haven't checked the lighting yet. Um, I put it up. My wife and I put it up, uh, but I have not recorded a video and went to my edit room and edited the video yet. So I don't know how this is going to turn out. It might be awful, and um, if it is, then this video might be awful. But the following, I'll, I'll fix the issue. So hope you enjoyed, and uh, yeah, make sure you pick up some Sterling. See you guys.